Hello people, today I'm going to show you how you can abuse a bug in TKN to completely skip killing monsters in the fire stage. Um, before we start, remember where your turn button is. Um, the default button is G. I'm gonna show it here. Um, yeah, here it is. The default button, uh, default button is G. Oh, I don't want to change it. Um, so, when we go in, you immediately have to press G and the button for line ref almost at the same time. So, we go into the portal, you press G and the button for line ref almost at the same time. Well, keep in mind you have to press G before line ref, of course. So, let's wait for the cooldown. Okay, let's go. So, we go in, press G and the li button for line ref. And if everything worked, um, we should now behind the fire wheel. Yep. And now it's basically just waiting until the firewall is killing all monsters. Ah, oh, firewall, what am I talking? Fire wheel. Okay, this was the first stage. Now for the second stage. Um, you can either choose just pressing it and then run through it and killing the wall or you just go in and wait both works um, keep in mind for that you should have a gravity pole without gravity pole it's really really hard so yeah let's try it out shall we you go through it Maybe use line drive, whatever. You shoot at it. Use high super armor breaking skills. Get pushed back by something random. And then you have to pray that you can kill it. And there we go. This is the second stage. And now this motherfucking orc here is really annoying. So you can stand up here and it doesn't hit you. Um, I recommend to not kill him because he can he can be a really big help later on when you solo this nest. So yeah, the fire wheel is doing a great job there. Um, in order that the goblin is helping you later, you are not allowed to pick any food up. So you can press on this food here, but you should not eat it. Oh, and there's a mortar. So this is probably the trickiest stage. So what do you have to do here to activate the fire wheel and skip it at the same time? You have to run like here and go back immediately. Um, it is really, really hard to do because sometimes you go too far to the gate and then you you bug yourself no not you don't bug yourself but you get just stuck and you cannot come back and the fire wheel is still spawning so let's try that oh, that didn't work didn't work either oh this is gonna be hard oh there we go you see just try it over and over and then you might get it. If you use this trick here um, for this stage as well, um, you kill the orc. Most of the, most of the time, when you solo this nest, um, you end up having either one orc at the end boss or none so it doesn't really matter if you kill them I think um, if someone is soloing this stuff for drops then he is either well <laughs> um, not so smart this is probably only for the achievement what? I'm getting bombed um, the achievement here for clearing it solo is called Glorious. It's a pretty decent title. 
yeah, you have to get that in order to get the great title, which is, um, with the change system, a pretty, pretty nice title for physical attackers. So yeah, the orc is dying now. Where is he? There we go. The wall is getting destroyed, the fire will disappears. And this gate should be open. There we go. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is by far, in my opinion, the hardest stage when you solo this nest. It is really, really, really annoying. And yeah, but that's not what I want to show here. So, well, stay tuned for the next video. I'm gonna show more stuff like that. Depends on what I can find and whatnot. I also show some Green Dragonist hardcore runs later on maybe and different stuff so yeah. See y'all.